Hello there guys! Welcome back to my channel. This is your teacher, Teacher Daryl Del Mundo. And today, I will teach you how to make another presentation in an application called Prezi. This is very different from PowerPoint presentation and the last time that I taught you, which is all about Canva. So all you have to do is to go to your browser, or Google Chrome or whatever it is. Then the first thing you need to do is to go to Prezi.com. So when you type to Prezi.com, then just type enter and then see there you will now go to its dashboard so in its dashboard you can see their create template start from scratch and convert powerpoint into prezi something like that and on your left side you can see their videos design presentations library so on and so forth created by me shared with me and uh, other stuffs okay so the first thing that we need to do or the click is to create template so when you are going to create template just click this one and then it will bring you to this window there you go so in this part you will see a lot of templates so this is just a one big template okay it's different from PowerPoint because PowerPoint has different slides on this part you only have one template and those template has a zoom in and zoom out kind of animation so that you will be able to see what will be your specification all about or your specific lesson or specific topic is all about. So for an instance, let us have the topic all about types of elements. And uh, let us find a template that is related to our topic. So let's find a topic or a template that is related to elements. Okay. Let's search more. For example, this one, this can be for a cell, something like that. Okay, let's search, search, and search. There you go. Let's try this one. 3D Atom. Just choose whatever template you wanted to use. And then after that, use this template. Title this presentation. This type. Types of elements. Or say three types of elements. Okay, then continue. anyone on the web Let's just wait for a while while we are waiting so as I said a while ago when you have your profile already it's like making your own profile again if you do not have yet your profile or your account in Prezi just make another account or just make your own account over here you can use your Facebook and you can use also your Gmail account okay and just put some information and some details of yours to create and then just log in here then you will have this free Prezi presentation online okay this way and there you go as you can see here at the middle we have the big picture which is all about the atom as you can see so our topic is all about the three types of elements okay so on your right side you can see there the zoom in kind of slide specific of the Prezi so when we click it see it's all about the introduction okay and then it's all about this one okay there you go then you can also go back there you go okay so when you're going to edit it just type here double tap it and then three just right there three types of elements 
So you can also arrange it here or preposition this one or change its position and then you can change the size over here decrease the size or increase the size and uh, this one is for the title part of the text and blue button and then here is the color of the font uh, bold and italicized then alignment the bullet okay so on this part if you want to change it just choose whatever you want here okay so uh, in my case i will choose this one and then let's go to introduction okay introduction there are 118 elements that can be found naturally and these elements are categorized into three types there you go so we can adjust it here then right after that we can go to overview again and then let's go to the next one explain your topic so when you're going to explain our topic it depends upon your topic how broad it is or how specific it is so just type three types of elements okay let's use the bullet form we have metals Non metals and metalloids. Okay, there you go. Okay, let's go back again over here and then when we go back here, you can type another part of your discussion. Okay, there you go. So let's go to show and tell. Okay. And by the way, you can also add text like what we have done a while ago. You can also add videos, images, and symbols that is very related to your topic. Then after you put all those things in your Prezi presentation, so you can type here your school name. So Insta for in instance, I have like the discussion or their teacher, Mr. Dariel Del Mundo. Okay, then you can write C A H S or Cayetano Aureliano High School. Aureliano High School. And then let us decrease the size. Okay, there you go. So we already decreased the size. Then just put it over here. And then there you go. Okay? So after that, when you finish all your slides over here, it's like zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, and zoom out. You can now create a present over here. Like for example, this one. Start presentation so that you can see in a preview over here. And then after that, you can download it. Okay, so here, also in share, we can use present, view link, collaborate, live Prezi, or Prezi video. So let's try to create. Let's continue. Okay, so on this part, you can make your video in making your Prezi. Okay, so since we're not going to create a video, then we are going to create a presentation. There you go. So this will be what it looks like. Okay. Oh, 
let's go back to the first one. So this will be your topic, and then introduction, and then let's go back here, and then there you go, and there you go, and there you go. Okay, so you can uh, customize and you can create your own present presentation using this one aside from your Canva and your PowerPoint presentation. Okay, and also in addition to this, you can also insert style over here. Just click it there and then use the background shape layout, colors, and text. So if you want to insert some text over here, just click it. Then you can insert wherever you want. Okay, click and then just insert which part of the presentation we wanted to insert the style okay or this text and then right after that you can also insert the followings like story blocks text images icons animations powerpoint and so on and videos chart and then you can also share it present or present it view link collaborate like Prezi and then Prezi video. So when you're done with your presentation, you can create a video out of it. You can include your face if you want or include yourself. And you can, you can also, do not want, if you do not want to include yourself, it's okay. You just choose this one. And, and then just click share or okay. Then there you go. Just enable the microphone. So this will be what it looks like. And then just press this play button to re record it. And let's wait for it. Then, then you can start talking, something like that. And then have an introduction about your topic. And then you can start making an introduction about it. And then so on and so forth. And this one and also this one okay and then if you are done with the recording you can uh, click done recording there you go and then the video will be saved in your account and then uh, if you are done you can save it also okay or you can record again there you go and you can uh, use it for next time and at the same time, you can share the link. Yeah. Over here, you can view the link. So just type your name and then you can create the link so that they will be able to see your Prezi all about or presentation in Prezi. Okay, create link. And so this link, you can control C and control V this one. You highlight it, then copy and paste it, and then send it to your students or send it to your colleagues, send it to your friends so that they will be able to know your presentation all about Prezi. Okay, then if you are done, do not forget to save it. Don't forget to save it. You should save it all the time. So that will be for today. And I hope you learned something all about Prezi presentation. So at the end, this will be what it looks like. There you go. There you go. And there you go. I hope you learned something today. This is your teacher, Teacher Daryl Del Mundo. And thank you for listening. Teacher Da signing off.